Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to sell courses on Shopify. So as you know, Shopify is not made to sell courses or digital files, they are made to sell some physical product. But that doesn't mean that you can't sell other stuff either. So today I'm going to show you how to sell courses with the help of Shopify app. Now, as always, if you want to add up some application that will help you with your business, you're going to want to go to Shopify App Store. If you search for courses on Shopify App Store, you will see a bunch of apps that will help you to sell your courses online on Shopify. So here, as you can see, you have Courses Plus and then we have LDT Online Courses and we have Inflow Membership and Courses. We have Thankific online courses and many more so i'm just going to use one app today to show you how to sell courses on shopify and that course app is going to be courses plus so this app have free plan available it has 4.9 rating and it has 158 review which is pretty nice in my opinion and then here on the description, it says that you can sell online courses or coaching programs via your stores with Courses Plus. You can join the industry of e-learning by selling your knowledge. You can create and sell digital product and digital downloads via your online stores and increase recurring revenue with the subscriptions feature. And Courses Plus app, you can easily create online courses with videos, images, quizzes, text, plan Zoom meetings with your students, etc. Courses and webinars helps you build up your product catalog, thus monetize your audience. So you can create and sell your own online courses. You can provide tests and exams with quizzes. You can monitor customers' progress and quiz score. You can generate PDF certificates for students who successfully completed your courses. And you can offer bundles and subscriptions-based memberships. So one of the things that I like about this app is that you can create certificates for your customers so that once they finish the courses they'll be able to use the certificates in the future so now that we know some things about courses plus we're going to go ahead and install it so go ahead and click on install and then you're going to go ahead and click on install on shopify and then once you're done they're going to give you a tutorial or a guideline on how to add your menu on courses so I'm just going to go ahead and click on this My Courses options on the left side of the screen because once you get your app installed, you'll be able to get this navigations menu specifically for Courses Plus app. Now, once you click on My Courses, you'll be able to start creating your courses. So you can do it by clicking on Create Course over here or on the button right here. So go ahead and click on Create Courses and we can start with the title, let's say, I'm just going to name it test course. And then you can add a description about what your courses is. For example, if you want it to be about baking, you can have the title, maybe like how to bake cheesecake and then add the descriptions about what your customer will get through this course. Maybe they will get your specific recipes or maybe they will get some ticks and trips and then you will provide them with any other things from this courses, you can go ahead and put it on the descriptions. I'm just going to skip it for now. And then I'm going to go ahead and click on next. And then you're going to want to set the pricing by choosing what kind of course it's going to be. Is it a one-time purchase? Is it a private? Is it an open courses? Or is it going to be free courses? Or will it be a subscription type of courses which will of course you to move up into the professional plan on courses plus but the other type of courses are free on courses plus so let's say this one is going to be a one-time purchase and then for the course price it's going to be 15 for me you can set it up to however you can set it up to whichever numbers you want it to be then i'm going to go ahead and click create course and now we got the course created so next you can also create sections for your course for example if you want to divide it into several video or maybe you want to divide it to several lessons you can create sections so i'm just going to create 
several for an example let's say it's going to be lesson one introduction then go ahead and click on save and then you can just go ahead and add up your next sections so let's say this one's going to be ingredients and then go ahead and click on save and then if you would like to add your lesson you can go ahead and click on add new lessons and then you can add some descriptions to it you can upload your video you can upload audio or pdf whatever it is that you need and the sections right here if you would like to upload anything you can just click on the button available and then upload it from your devices and once you're done you can go ahead and click on save i'm just going to go back for now and you can also add quiz if you want by clicking on this add quiz options it is going to be a fun thing and also going to make it super helpful for your customers or for your student to learn even more because their knowledge are going to be challenged over here i think adding quizzes it's a very interesting and fun ways to help your customers or your students to learn so that is how you can add sections as well as lessons and then you can settings even more by adding drip content or settings the limit course access etc but you do will have to upgrade your plan so i'm going to show you the pricing of the plans that they have so i am now currently on the demo plan and with the demo plan everything is free i can create up to five lessons and i think i have unlimited quizzes to create but if you would like to have more options or if you would like to be able to enjoy the full benefit you can take a look at the other plan the first one they have basic plans and it's around 30 dollars a month and here are the benefits that you can have and then next they have the professional plan with $80 per month and then enterprise plan with almost $200 per month. So you can choose on the best plan for you and enjoy the benefit that comes with the plan. And then if your customer is done with the course, you can definitely send them certificates. But you need the basic plan in order to create certificates enabled so if you're on basic plans all you have to do is click on this enable button and you can also create certificates for every quizzes and then if you would like to add a logo to certificate you can just upload it on this part right here then you can edit the issued by the issued date the student's date as well as the email templates that your student will receive once they're done with the courses and that's basically it that is how you can sell courses on shopify i hope this tutorial is helpful for you thank you so much for watching and have a great day